Let's do this. You guys ready for this? Heck yeah. I love my Victoria's Secret band because I can throw my phone in there for my music. Or credit card, cash, whatever. Pick up something on the run. Gotta stay hydrated, most importantly. Every day for 10 minutes, you should sweat. Even if you just run around in your living room or if you come to a public park and act like a maniac. 10 minutes a day, get your sweat on. Let's do this. So you can find a park bench or anything really in a public place and do some push-ups. Do them really, really slow. Keep your arms all the way tucked in. Slower the better for the toning so you don't bulk up. And then you move your arms outward for a wide push-up. Same thing. 10 to 12, you can do them in three sets. High knees. Find a bench, a trash can, whatever it is. <laughs> do these for about a minute. <laughs> and of course, tricep dips the back of our arm because we are always trying to get rid of that arm flab. <laughs> so always so important to stretch in the beginning and the end, mostly at the end when you're done. A good jog in the beginning is always a good warm up as well. But a few target points, your glutes, your hamstrings, and your knees. So I'll show you really quick. Simple and basic, legs straight in front of you, lift all the way up. Fold forward and keep your back flat. You don't need to go all the way down and be all bendy and crazy. Just keep a straight stretch back and you'll feel it deep in your hamstrings. Second, we'll do knead the, so knead the thread. I'll thread the needle. So you do right leg over your thigh and you just pull in. So this stretches your, your glutes, really important. Same thing on the other side. <laughs> And I'd even say you can hold this for up to two, three minutes if you want to. And then last, here, your IT bands. So you just wanna lay back, stretch. Don't let your knees fold in. Same thing on the other side. If this is uncomfortable for your knees, which it is for a lot of people, including myself sometimes, just stand up, cross your legs, lean forward, and you'll get a whole stretch all on the back side of your thigh, which is your IT band on the side here. And that's it. There's obviously a million more stretches that you should do, but those are kind of the three basic that I always feel are most important after a jog, after squats, after kicks, after any of it. Cool? Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Leave video requests in the comment section below.